friends, today I will tell you a beautiful story. The story is about a sunflower garden. Hope you like it very much. Please subscribe my channel before starting the story. So let's get started, guys. In the heart of a small countryside town, nestled between rolling hills and meandering streams, there existed a sunflower garden unlike any other. It was tended lovingly by an elderly couple, Mr. and Mrs. Thompson, who had dedicated their lives to nurturing this vibrant sea of golden blooms. The garden stretched across several acres behind their quaint cottage, where each morning, the sun would rise over the eastern hills and cast its warm rays upon rows upon rows of sunflowers. The Thompsons believed that these flowers held a special magic, not just in their sunny appearance, but in the way they seemed to turn towards the sun throughout the day, as if chasing its light. The couple had planted their first sunflower seeds decades ago, shortly after they were married. What began as a modest patch of yellow blossoms had flourished over the years into a breathtaking spectacle that drew visitors from neighboring towns and cities. People would come to wander the maze-like paths that wound through the garden, basking in the cheerful glow of the sunflowers and marveling at their towering heights. Springtime was always a flurry of activity in the garden. Mr. Thompson would carefully prepare the soil, tending to each row with meticulous care, while Mrs. Thompson would plant the seeds with a gentle touch that seemed to coax life from the earth itself. They worked side by side, their weathered hands and knowing smiles a testament to their years of shared dedication. As the seasons changed and summer approached, the sunflowers began to bloom in earnest. Each day brought new growth, tiny green shoots stretching skyward, unfurling into massive flower heads that swayed gently in the breeze. The garden became a symphony of color and motion, a living tapestry that seemed to dance with the rhythm of the sun. Visitors would often find Mr. Thompson sitting on a weathered bench near the garden's edge, a contented smile on his face as he watched the sunflowers sway. He would regale them with stories of the garden's history, of the trials and triumphs they had faced over the years. Mrs. Thompson, ever the gracious hostess, would offer freshly baked goods and lemonade, her laughter ringing out like wind chimes on a summer's day. As autumn approached, the sunflowers would begin to bow their heads, their once vibrant petals fading to shades of gold and brown. It was a bittersweet time for the Thompsons, a reminder of the fleeting beauty of each season. Yet, they found solace in knowing that their garden had brought joy to so many, and that its legacy would endure long after they were gone. Winter would blanket the countryside in a quiet stillness, and the sunflower garden would sleep beneath a blanket of snow. But come springtime, the cycle would begin anew, the garden would awaken once more, bursting forth with renewed vigor and the promise of another season filled with sunshine and laughter. For the Thompsons, their sunflower garden was more than just a collection of flowers. It was a testament to their love, their resilience, and their enduring belief in the power of beauty to brighten the world. And as they grew older, they knew that as long as there were sunflowers in bloom, their legacy would continue to bloom alongside them, a beacon of hope and happiness for all who passed through its gates. Friends, Today our story is up to I. If you like our story, like, comment and share. Stay with us by subscribing to our channel for more such beautiful stories. Guys, thank you very much.